All right, welcome to Let's Play Knights of the Old Republic, part 43. I'm just splitting off because that part was starting to get really long. Remember, we charged the lie and the losses were terrible. General, it would be suicide to go forward. There's just too few of us. We already lost half the men just getting to the path. They've got the rest of the company pinned down by the crash site. You can't possibly ask the troops to go forward. If you ask us to charge, will it make a difference? Will our sacrifice mean something? We won, though. We, we will press forward if you ask it. The path is mine. If you ask us to charge, there will be losses, General. Let me go first this time. I'll try to disable the mines. Thank you, General. Thank you. So they can disable the mines. No force powers in here, though, of course. And now we fight. Down and up. It all rip. We're just using our force powers. as well. is empty, huh?
Diary Cell and Data Pad. This is the Journal of the Jedi Nebulish. Most of the data has been purposely deleted. One entry remains the visions, the visions. They thought to trick me by taking the form of my fellow Jedi. My discipline is so strong I tricked them back. One fell to the Shirak, and the other fell to my lightsaber. Save our heels. I think that's the Dark Lord himself. You are to be commended for making it this far. What are you doing here? You've revisited the dark moments of your past, and now you must face the present. What do you mean? Your confusion is natural. The others and I will help you understand. The others? Get away from her! She's a dark Jedi. I've had enough of your snide contempt. Hey, what's the commotion here? Stay out of this, Beodor. This is a personal dispute between Atten and myself. You're threatening Atten with a lightsaber, and I'm supposed to just stay out of it? No. Can I just say something? The three of you would challenge me? You sorely underestimate the power of the Force. Think again, Kreia. Your dark influence will end. Your friends are all arrayed against me. Will you stand for this? You, of all people, would judge me so. Am I not worthy of redemption? I had more questions than answers there, really. Many people are wondering where the Great Revan disappeared to.
this was all a test. The dangers you faced in this tomb were real, but these images of the past serve to prepare you for your future. What do you know of the sure future? You have felt what awaits. Events are shaping themselves about you, seeking to draw you into their center. You overestimate the power of the tomb. Any change you feel is coming from within yourself. Instinctually, you know your true path. Trust in your feelings. They will lead you in conquering the many challenges that the future holds for you. Is I supposed to learn Sometimes, something? A momentary insight is worth lifetimes of experience. You may not yet understand what you learned here. That wisdom will come in the future. Alright. Search the room you are in. You should be able to unlock a passage that leads outside the tomb. We got a double blader. That's an immense loot. Feeling yeah, very looty. Back out we get. Can we go back? Nope. So we're st stuck. We just have to return to the ship and move on from there, I guess. Is 
Got a message from Kavar. Still functioning. Never mind. Leave the workbench alone for now. What we need to do is, um, we can't take Kraya with, but we can. a couple dueling powers force immunity what else can we throw a saber Academy. I'm just gonna have a quick check. Okay. This kind of a uh, meet you there kind of thing. Uh, I guess we're just stuck. I'm going to change his igniter to green, I think. Of course. It would be my pleasure. Meditation, Envy? Why don't you go sit on a rocket? Calm down. What is your problem? I don't want to talk about it. All right. You know, Atten, sometimes it's no wonder you can't figure yourself out the way you lie to yourself all the time. I've hunted a lot of people in my line of work, but I never met someone who wants to get lost more than you do. And I've got a pretty good idea why, but not the whole picture. I will, though. My advice? Come clean before I find out. And stop watching her. She's got enough problems. I wish to show you something. 
What? Not with words, but by feeling it. With the Force, close your eyes. Feel the universe. Strip away the life on board the ship. Someone is creating an echo. A resonance in the Force. Someone is consuming life, using it to feed their hunger. Each dying world creates an echo in the Force. And as the echoes build, it becomes a noise. Deafening. Destructive. It touches all life in ways that are invisible to see. The darkness, the despair created from such events breeds and grows. Someone is bringing the dark side to the galaxy through destruction. A critical point is approaching. And the wound must be healed. Yep. Alright. Now let me mess with these sabers. I'm fine with bronze, actually. And energy cell. Most interesting is this. I'm not sure if it will actually change with how the lightsaber's tuned. But we'll humor her and remove it and see if it changes anything. Crystal, let me focus on the crystal for a moment. There, now it is fully in tune with you again. Is there something else you wished? Okay, it looks like it does actually become a little bit stronger. Plating Mark II. Gotta leave. Two ducks and and I believe we will take Mandalore and the disciple along. And 
and he levels up. Beats. Yeah, I'll give him better saving throws, I guess. I guess we might as well earn some experience. Yeah, once we get back onto Onderon, I'm gonna call it a night. Corbon kind of ran longer than I was expecting. Come back, weird. I was kind of hoping we would get some experience, but it looks like we just have to walk. Should have used the guide. Oh well. That's actually worth it. Instead of blowing up a holocron, we get access to a cache. Onasi oh, Blaster, nice. I'm gonna peek at that, actually. Well, I'll actually equip it, but I just wanted to check it out. It's a decent blaster. Was changed. This morning, General Vaklu met with the Council of Lords and declared that the Queen was guilty of treason. He'll be made regent if Talia and her royal guard are defeated. The military is divided on who to support. Civil war has fallen on Isis. 
Can we help Queen I Talia? I doubt that Queen Talia and her advisor will survive until nightfall. The balance of forces seem to favor Queen Talia. The royal palace is heavily fortified and defensible, and most of the soldiers are loyal to her. But Vaklu has new allies, Sith soldiers and their masters. The war has also driven the caged beasts in the streets mad. Braylor and I both concur. She doesn't stand a chance. You underestimate the Force, Mandalorian. I sense that we may still get to Master Kavar in time. I sense there is something stirring on the moon itself. Tell me, have your senses picked up anything from Duxon? Yes. Yes, we have. How? We picked up some transmissions from nearby in the jungle. We only have our shuttle sensors, so we know nothing more than that. Those transmissions are the enemy. They are linked to the fate of Onderon. They must be stopped. Otherwise, the Mandalorian is right. Master Kavar and Queen Talia won't survive this day. Dividing our forces at a time like this is foolhardy. And this is why a common soldier will never triumph against a Jedi. Your military tactics are nothing compared to the Force. It is essential and inevitable that we face both enemies at the same time. I have to lead the group heading to the Royal Palace, don't I? You... you are correct. You must choose who will lead the expedition through the jungle to find our enemies and defeat them. I'll do it, but you're still my bounty. You won't lose me this easily. You should send two others to go with the leader. Who else will accompany the expedition? Uh, uh, Visus. Very well. And who else? Atten. If you say so. Now, are you certain of your choices? No, but. Mandalorian we'll warriors will go with you to find the enemy camp. Just let me know when you want to head out. If you need supplies, talk with Kex. After you get into the jungle, you might not have another opportunity to stock up. Let me know if you want to go now. I'm ready. They should head out now. As you wish. Mandalore has arranged for special transportation to get to Isis. Finally, we're close to our objective. I sent the rest of my men to secure the trail behind us. My troops will keep the path to the Mandalorian camp clear. Ahead lies the enemy. I can follow you a little bit further. But then I will set up command and control for my unit in the field. So lead on. All right. Um. We'll level up, Nira. Okay. More powers. It's gonna dig as deep into force lightning as we can. And we're gonna call it a day. Thank you guys for watching. Hope you enjoyed. If you haven't haven't already done so, then feel free to follow button one time or sub like and share if you're on YouTube. Take care guys, till next time we'll be seeing ya later on.